Hey everyone, welcome back to this Tosca automation playlist. In this short video, I'm going to show you how you can import folder structure right from a Microsoft Excel sheet. Now, if you use Microsoft Excel to basically build your automated tests, then you can import your tree structure directly into Tosca Commander. So you don't have to manually build all the folders uh, into your component folder in Tosca. You can directly use whatever you have in Microsoft Excel or what you have already built in Microsoft Excel and write it straight into your Tosca component folder, right? So let's see how we can do this. The only thing to keep in mind is that you need to follow some requirements in order to import your tree structure from Microsoft Excel to Tosca. So uh, let's see an example of what we are going to import, right? So I have got this particular folder structure. Okay, so this is from the vehicle insurance website. We have used this many times uh, to automate some test cases. And this is how my test case folder structure should look like, okay? So I've got uh, the main folder and then there are subfolders like pre-processing, process, and post-processing. So this is following the best practices to build our test cases. And then inside pre-processing, we have open application. Uh, in, inside the process, we have the actual uh, test case, okay? So the flow of the application, like uh, selecting vehicle data, and then entering vehicle data, entering personal data, entering insurance data, and then uh, choosing the product and uh, doing the premium calculation and then checking the premiums like insurance tax uh, according to the payment, okay? And then in post-processing, uh, we have the close application, okay? So you can see in this structure, uh, we have got different levels of uh, folders, right? And these folders uh, will contain different test cases, right? So this is the folder structure I want to build in Tosca. So instead of going to Tosca and building this folders one by one, which will take some time, right? So if I've got this, or if I want to build this in Excel quickly, and then directly import it uh, into my Tosca, right? So I can do that uh, by just uh, having a structure like this, okay? So the minimum requirements uh, you need to fulfill when you are building your Excel, right? Or if you want to import the tree structure from Excel to Tosca, uh, the objects which you are building, they should be hierarchically structured, okay? In columns from left to right, okay? So you can see there is a hierarchy here. So the vehicle insurance offer, so this is the parent uh, object. Inside this, we have got pre-processing and you can see this is uh, in first column and pre-processing process and post-processing. So these are in the second column, okay? And then, uh, there is another um, subfolder, which is open application. Similarly, there are other folders here as well. So these are in the third column. And finally, the final folder is in the fourth column. Okay, so this is the hierarchical structure which you need to follow in Excel, the way you want to build it in your Tosca uh, component folder. Okay, so you need to put it in different columns, okay, or, or rows and uh, that should be from left to right okay so objects of the same hierarchical level uh, are in the same column okay so you can see here these are all the same levels these uh, objects are at the same level right so they are present in just one column and similarly for this they are present in another column so you need to make sure that objects uh, at the same level have to be in the same column also, you need to make sure that there can be only one value per row, okay? So you cannot have two values in the same row. So make sure of that. And uh, the structure should have uh, less than 15 levels, okay? So you cannot have more than 15 levels uh, in the structure, right? So these are the things you need to take care of when uh, you are trying to uh, import your T-structure from Microsoft Excel uh, to Tosca. Okay, now coming to the actual steps on how to import this particular uh, structure which I built on Excel sheet into my Tosca commander, right? So for this, what we need to do, 
uh, first come here and select all the rows which you have in your structure and click on control plus c to copy it okay and then go back to tosca commander here um, i can export it into any folder but it's best practice to basically build a component folder okay so i will name it vehicle or um, i will name it import from excel okay and then inside this right uh, when you right click on this you will see there is an option called create folder structure you can also use shortcuts like control n and control s okay and that will basically um, build a structure from the copied cells of your excel sheet okay so if i right click on this and i click on this create structure you will see the structure will be automatically created inside this folder okay so you can create it um, inside any folder you can create a test case folder and then put this inside that or you can put it inside a component folder you can do it anywhere you like now if i want to see all my folders uh, beneath this level then i can do a expand all here and you will see that all the folders uh, which were present in our excel sheet structure has been created here okay uh, with the hierarchical structure which we had okay with all the levels so you can see here uh, there is process pre-processing and post-processing obviously they are not in the right order but you can always change them okay okay so uh, that's how you can create any folder structure or basically import your folder structure right from your excel sheets so if you are building or if you're maintaining your test cases before tosca in some excel sheet uh, you can build a structure like this and uh, put it together uh, or import it uh, into your tosca project okay so this could be useful uh, in some cases but uh, i just wanted to show you in the short video how you can do this so that's all for this video uh, i hope you enjoyed it and you learned something new today uh, there are lots more videos coming up so uh, do remember to subscribe to our channel and until the next video keep watching and keep learning tosca uh, at our channel qscript